we have a new pew pew, yay! Hello there, in this update Bethesda introduced a new pew pew, circuit breaker. Yokizoki, so let's quickly craft one. It would be energy gun, right? Yeah, circuit breaker. So we need adhesive, gear, oil, screw, steel and wood. Plus 50% armor penetration, great, faster reload and uh, successful final round shot will create an energy blast that deals damage and stuns enemies within 50 feet. Stunned enemies will be immune to being stunned again for 10 seconds. Period. Okay, let's try it out. As you can see it's available from level 10 but of course we need level 50 version. So we have anti-armor, fast reload, energy pistol with a final round dealing area damage and stunning magic. That's interesting. Speaking of mods, mm, we have something locked. Maybe paint, I don't know. Okay, here we go with uh, calibrated receiver, of course. More critical damage. Let's go Vats. Because Vats crit build is the best what you can do with this weapon. Calibrated receiver, welcome aboard. Okay, here we go with some, hmm, maybe with true long barrel, hip fire accuracy, yeah, let's go with true long barrel. Senorito, bienvenido. Speaking of grip, of course we go with forceful grip, right? Yeah, forceful grip. Hello. Then we have magazines and a large magazine, of course. Sights, uh, I go as always with reflex sight. And finally, energy muzzle, yeah, no suppressor. Speaking of paints, still no paints, but actually I like this one. Looking beautiful. Yoki's the keys, and here's my build. I'm using armor to farm experience, I'm using plus one intelligence, all pieces, nothing interesting. Speaking of under armor, I'm using shielded vault 94 jumpsuit, because it gives plus two luck. By the way, let's check the damage ideal and uh, 1 of 4, 104. Hmm, not that great, but anyways. Speaking of my perk loadout, I have some food perks under strength plus blocker. Uh, here, tank killer works with pistols, right? Grenadier. We deal some area damage, so let's check it out. Glow sight. Glowies, I'm coming for you. And concentrated fire, let's have it rank 3 just in case. If your weapon is not automatic, this version is better. Can fiend, fireproof, and ready cool are always cool. Strange numbers. Not playing in teams today, but in general I am, so it's better to have it. Tenderizer deals more damage. Nerd rage. Because I go bloody demo expert, well, I deal some area damage, so we're gonna check it out how it works. And the grenadier, of course. Science combo, because our weapon is energy. Yeah, I have full combo, right? Science, expert, and uh, master. Better is included because mm, why not? Foodie builds for the win. Okay, moving to agility. Escape artist is always good, and today we're gonna try stealth gameplay. Stealth gunslinger gameplay. Master, uh, expert, gunslinger, adrenaline just rank 1, because even at rank 1 is quite effective. Plus 36% damage. And gun fu, yeah, what's gameplay? Serendipity is a must-have. Curator, well, I'm, I will try to play without bubbleheads, without magazines, but it is always nice to have it. Just in case. Starched jeans is a must-have. Good result. Well, it is important for me because I have a lot of company tea now, a lot of cranberry relish, a lot of everything. And finally, critical savvy and better criticals because Valt's Creed build. My legendary perks. Basically, legendary specials and follow through. <laughs> That's all. If we check my specials, I have luck 37. Enough to make every second shot critical. And speaking of my mutations, here they are. The same for commando, I believe. Yeah, the same. Well, first let's try under level minions. One, two, oh, he's dead. One, two. Is he dead? Ah, oh, no. Now, yes. Boom, 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 and what crit? Yay, he's dead. 
Speaking of stealth status, I can say that uh, I'm in caution the whole time. Ah, <laughs> and already in danger. Damn. I think we should try it at closer range. So now I'm hidden. Boom. Caution. Let's get closer to someone. Doggy. Caution, still caution. Okay, here. Oh, already in danger. I'd say that this weapon is effective for stealth build if you don't get super close. At mid range, it's fine. And here I'm not taking damage because I'm immortal on my custom world. For low health Vascrit builds, Herbivore is the best option because you can use a very easy to make food buff, Blight Soup, that gives you plus 100% more crit damage. And further, I'm gonna use it to see if I can to shot 100 level minis. And additionally, we can try this Tanyan magic. Okay, last shot, successful shot, and uh, like a hmm. rad rope. yeah, it does suck. Oh no no no! Why? I think we can try it again, but in less hostile environment. Successful last shot here, and uh, oh, even my PC has been stunned. But the effect lasts only two seconds. Or what? Let's try it again. And one, and two, and three, and four, and. Uh, almost five and one and two and three and four and five I think uh, five seconds and something little for my PC <laughs> by the way the animation of your previous blast doesn't go away <laughs> but let's see if you can blast through walls senorito get prepared boom uh, and uh, 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 yay it goes through walls yay Wait a minute, and where's the damage? <laughs> so, Bethesda kinda forgot to add some stunning damage, because that wasn't enough. Red Roach hits harder than Circuit Breaker. Basically, the new mechanic is helpful, but not a game changer like Freezing Effect Cold Shoulder provides you with. As I understood, this weapon is not super loud. It makes some sound, but not that much. Oh, now he can see me. So, once again, stealth gameplay is possible if you maintain distance. And in stealth mode, you can to shot 100 level mini. Oh, I missed, but yeah, basically, the shots and he's dead. And if you're not, sometimes it can take 3 shots, sometimes 2. And of course, if you wanna show off your skill, Bethesda will let you suck with this kind of damage. So, it's better to go with Vats Creed, if you can. I tried to test if Grenadier does something and visually the orb looks bigger. Inside West Tech I had only one successful attempt, but even in this case, the distance is not the same. So, I don't know. If Grenadier somehow affects this tiny effect, it definitely not doubles it. Speaking of additional area damage, well, Demolition Expert is not relevant here, because anyways, this damage is super low. Yes, you will be able to attack all enemies around, but explosive weapon is better. Here's the result. Oh, thank you. So, is Circuit Breaker is a good weapon? Definitely yes for a new player who has nothing else. And not that great for someone who actually runs a pistol build. Big thank you for watching, I will see you later, bye bye!